troubling signs Utahns are struggling with their mental health. The Utah Department of Health and Human Services reports 717 Utahns died by suicide in 2022. That's an almost 12% increase from 2021. It's a trend researchers in Utah are actively trying to reverse, including Huntsman Mental Health Institute psychiatry professor Dr. Hillary Kuhn. I sat down with her about a study she co-authored that was recently published. They analyzed data from 22 different populations around the world, looking at biological factors that can contribute to suicide attempts and suicide deaths. Suicide is, in my mind, just like any other kind of complex disease, like cancer, like diabetes, like heart disease. This study pulls out the piece of the puzzle that's genetic. Dr. Kuhn says the study findings show a dozen genetic variations associated with a risk of attempting suicide. Those genetic variations have also been linked to health issues that include chronic pain, impulsivity, ADHD, pulmonary conditions, heart disease, and smoking. This doesn't necessarily mean that you ha if you have one of those conditions that you're destined to become suicidal, right? very complicated. This is such a complicated situation. What we're saying is that this may be linked to some vulnerability in some individuals. And Dr. Kuhn looks at this study's findings as a great first step, but the genetic piece of the puzzle is not all that meaningful without understanding environmental and social stressors that can also be contributory factors in suicides. If you or someone you know is struggling with thoughts of suicide, Know that help is always available. The Utah Crisis Line can be reached by dialing the number on your screen, 1-800-273-TALK.